We're speaking with Companion Pet Clinic. I have Dr. Campanile here and Dr. Brandon Young for the first time here on Radio Phoenix and Full Moon Hacksaw Program. Hi, Dr. C. How's it going? Very well. Very good morning. And Dr. Brandon, uh, thank you from the bottom of our hearts for supporting community radio and jazz and blues radio with the Full Moon Hacksaw Program. We've talked a little bit about how digital is happening today, and but with our pets, our companions, uh, that pretty much stays the same through. We can't put uh, pet care on digital, can we? Not that I know of. <laughs> I mean, it takes, uh, in, in, in other words, you take care of Jelly and Ashley, my two dogs. They're in tip-top shape, and I need to bring them in when something's going on. I can find you online, but to really bring in uh, and have that one-on-one -on -one care, that's still the human touch. Would you say, Dr. Brennan? Yes, most definitely. Tell us about yourself. Where did you go to school, and how did you want to take care of pets? Uh, I did my undergraduate at Michigan State University, and I went to veterinary school at Ross University and New University. Moved out here after veterinary school, and have been practicing ever since. So you were in the cold country, and did anything about the weather bring you out here? Yeah, a lot of it had to do with the weather. I'm one of those people that uh, enjoy going to the snow. I don't necessarily need the snow to come to me. Gotcha, gotcha. That's, <laughs> That's well said. Well said. And, and how about you, Dr. C? Well, I've been doing this for so long, I forget the, how I started. But it's, uh, <laughs> it's been about 40 plus years now. I've been uh, taking care of animals, small animals for the most part. A little bit of time working with the horses back east. No kidding. Yeah. No kidding. Mm -hmm. So small animals, uh, by that you mean the dogs and dogs, cats? Dogs, cats, and anything you can carry in. That's about okay. it. Okay. Uh, you guys uh, handle reptiles? Very infrequently. Okay. okay. <laughs> on occasion, I have a couple of reptiles at home, bearded dragons, and uh, on occasion we'll see a reptile. No kidding. No yeah. kidding. Now, I really enjoy coming in to see you uh, when it comes time to take care of our pets. Routine maintenance, anything that comes up. In fact, Dr. C, I found out about you because we had a special needs dog at one time, uh -huh. and you were referred by a friend, an animal lover, and she assured me that you have that compassion <laughs> uh, with the uh, pets and the, the owners, and I found that to be true. I walked in the first time I saw you, you were coming into work, and it's just like you would rather be doing nothing else. You really had that attitude. That's what attracts me to Companion Pet Clinic. Um, any uh, comments on that? Uh, well, I do enjoy the, the rescue work. Uh, we work with uh, local people here for about 15 years now, and it's a part of our everyday routine. So. Uh, uh, it's a, sort of a labor of love, but it, it has a lot of rewards because it, it, gives us, it gives back quite a bit. Love is, yeah. is the key word there. There will be viewers on your website, Companion Pet Clinic of Phoenix, Arizona, and there will be viewers on the Full Moon Hacksaw website. So what did you want to say to them in closing? <laughs> you know, if you have any questions, concerns regarding your pets, you know, we're always here for you. You know, we love and enjoy what we do, and we're out here to help you. And, uh, you know, we're uh, always happy to see you. And we're happy to see you as well. So thank you again for your support of community radio and the jazz and the blues and so much more that this radio and digital is becoming. I find it exciting. And with the help of you guys, we can keep this thing going and continue to grow this thing. Thank you again. You're very welcome. Thank Thanks. you.